Hello everyone, welcome to a foreign farming in the Philippines. Well, I'm going to be transferring some more Azola. Uh, my trusty scoop there and I got a bucket. So I'm going to take some out of that first pit there and out of this one and out of this one, so that's four. Uh, this is the urea pit that continues to kind of struggle along. Uh, really need to flush the water out of this one because the straight urea is just not doing that well. The Zola is a darker green but it doesn't grow fast so I need to get this water out. I'll just lower this here. I don't even think I'm gonna... I may harvest one scoop out of this. It's just not producing like uh, those first three there. So I'll harvest from those three pits. This one is actually full enough to harvest from now. This is the first pit that I transferred to. Not a full bucket out of this one, just but a couple scoops. This one is almost ready. I could probably take a couple scoops out of this one. definitely take a couple scoops out of this one because I can see when it's kind of folded on itself like that you can see it's it looks like a little uh, miniature mountain range there if you were an ant you would think you were in the Alps so I can take a full bucket out of this one so from those five or six pits I'll transfer into three of these pits here and get them going and then we're almost then we're almost there I put in these three pits and we've only got two more pits to fill after that so we only got five pits these here are almost recovered themselves this one here is almost full this one continues to fill in on its own. This one has, has a few little pieces in it. I need to run some fresh water into these pits. Uh, this one's kind of loping along. Yeah, these first several pits here need some fresh water in them, so I'm going to do just that, especially this first pit. You can see from the muddy water in these first two pits, these are the ones that have the fish in them and they're keeping it all stirred up in the bottom. Uh, so these need some these need some fresh water in them. I think I'll just start the pump. I'll come along and shovel this up and get this where these first pits here will hold as much water as I can get them to hold and start running some of this water through. All the other pits have been circulated twice now so I'm pretty confident that the water's fine in those. So I'm just going to start pushing this water through. So some transfer and some water exchange and we're good to go. We may have all these I had when I had first started transferring it I was thinking we'd have all these pits in production by this Saturday because I think I took that video uh, last Friday when I first started transferring thinking that by this next Saturday I would have all the pits in production but it's looking like it's only going to take another two or three days because all these pits that I've transferred into with uh, the exception of this one are already up and going so it's a, the production is exponentially increasing so I may get all these producing twice as fast as what I thought I was going to happen that's a good thing all right well I got a good start of Azola in these three pits here. I would imagine that's about a, 
a quarter coverage so I would expect in two days that these three pits would be full because it'll double again in 24 hours which would get them about half full <coughs> and double again in 24 hours after that <coughs> excuse me <coughs> So in two days, those pits there should be producing. Yeah, right at the moment, that's not a smoker's cough. I got a little water down the wrong way, firing up this siphon. Somehow I <laughs> uh, got some of that in my lungs. It didn't like it much. I thought my coughing fit was over, but I guess not. I'm draining the as much water as I can out of this one siphoning it out just out of this pit uh, I've isolated it and I'm going to try to get as much water out of it as I can and to put fresh water in it these are the three test pits here uh, the one on the end is 14 14 14 which has turned out to work the best this one is the uh, 1648 which is okay and this is the one Tata I wanted he wanted the straight urea because at the municipal uh, at the municipal Azola pits they just used some cow dung and urea so he thought that's the way we should go <coughs> I can tell you that adding straight urea fertilizer we only added one cup uh, I can tell you that that is the wrong thing to do uh, these pits, this Azola, does not like urea, nitrogen, it's the same thing. Uh, so I'm draining this water out because this Azola is dying from too much nitrogen, which is always the problem with Azola. I just wanted to, uh, to uh, appease Tatai to ease his mind so that he would have a firm answer, and myself as well. Uh, following the example of the municipality, uh, I can I can see problems in their future uh, for them adding the straight urea. I'll go back there in a couple weeks and look at their pits and see how they're doing. Uh, so that's the that's the progress on the pits. All right, well, I'm getting out of this rain. I finished draining this pit. It's most of the well, most of the way drained. I'm gonna shut the pump off. The water's coming into that that pit right there. So I'm, I'm gonna leave this until tomorrow, or it quits raining, one or the other. I'm getting out of this rain. I, this isn't a thunderstorm. It's too big. This is an actual weather front, I think. So I don't think it's going to, this isn't just a five minute storm, this is going to last a while. So I'm going to head to the house. Thank you everyone. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe.